So today I'm talking about a Honda with the P1324 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a Honda P1324 code? Well, it's a knock sensor power source circuit low voltage. And what is a knock sensor? Well, the knock sensor detects vibrations that come from a knock or irregularity in combustion and sends a signal to the engine control computer, which then adjusts the timing to correct the knock. And so basically while an engine has other components that get the timing all correct, this can get off a little bit sometimes. And when the timing is off, it can cause problems with the cylinders firing correctly, which causes a knock. And the knock sensor picks this up and it sends this information back to the onboard computer, which can use this information to adjust the timing and help the engine run the best that it can. And one thing to keep in mind with the knock sensor is sometimes timing can get knocked off by something else. Like if you have a bad camp sensor or something like that, sometimes something else can throw off the engine timing. And then the knock sensor is detecting this and the onboard computer is making up for this. So always keep that in mind. Be sure to check for other codes. If you're getting another code for a cam sensor or a crankshaft position sensor or something like that, then be sure to look at those. And so some possible causes, well, it could be a bad knock sensor, it could be in the wiring, it could be a blown fuse, and it's possible the engine timing is off. But like I said, you'll probably get other codes if the engine timing is off. And so the first thing to do when you get this code is to go locate where the knock sensor is located on your particular engine, since there can be some differences between the Hondas. And it's really going to vary. It's always a good idea to go get a diagram for your particular engine and year. For example, here's a 2002 Honda Odyssey and the knock sensor sensor is going to be right up here on the side of the engine. There can be multiple sensors. Sometimes there could be two. So that's something to keep in mind. Here's another example of 2003 Honda Accord and the knock sensor would be right up here on the side of the engine. And so like I said, there can be some differences where it's located. But the first thing to do is go locate where the knock sensor is located on your particular vehicle. And then once you locate it, be sure to check out that wiring real good. Because anything wrong with the wiring, open, short, anything like this is going to cause the same symptoms as a bad sensor. So you want to check that out. Be sure that it looks like it's good. Also keep in mind that these aren't a fuse. It can be somewhat vague on which fuse it is or where it's located. And so if you have a really hard problem that you can't fix or solve, then be sure to look for a blown fuse. If you check out the wiring and that looks good, no blown fuses or anything like that, then very likely that sensor has just failed. You can't test it if you want to. If you have a meter, you could check it for like continuity and things like this. It's pretty easy to do. There's some good YouTube videos on how you go about testing these if you wanted to. But at this point, if you checked everything else out, then very likely that knock sensor just needs to be replaced. They're usually fairly easy to replace, but it's going to depend on where they're located. Sometimes they can be located in some really bad spots, like underneath the intake manifold or something like that. So it's going to vary from engine to engine how difficult it is to remove and to replace. But the sensor itself, you usually just screw out and just screw in the new one and attach the wiring and you'd be good to go. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to make a quick video on how you go about fixing a Honda with the P1324 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.